All right, so I was getting kind of tired of using a uh, weed eater brand weed blower that blew pretty slow, wasn't too powerful, just couldn't handle the tasks that I needed it to. So my birthday's coming up on the 21st, and today's the 19th, but I got my birthday money early. So I went out today, I was actually going to uh, buy an Echo PB250 at a small engine shop. The only thing I didn't like about it was that they opened the box for you and test it out. And I like to do my things a certain way, differently than others do. And I just wanted to open it up myself from the box, see all the contents, everything like that and run it the way that I would like to run it the very first time, not have somebody else do it. So it was a bit of a heftier price at a Home Depot, but it was fine because when I went to Home Depot, I got a price match. They matched the price, plus they gave me 10% off, so that's pretty good. So now I'm gonna unbox it and I'm gonna stir it up for the first time too give it a little bit of a test run after I break in the engine. So, we'll uh, start unboxing it. Knife set I bought today as well. Um, I had been using the Stanley ones. These ones are Mastercraft and they're made in the USA. They had a 50 pack on sale for $3 so I couldn't really uh, go wrong there. control tubing which has a posi lock it's echo's branded posi lock set those to the side right now we have some echo power blend two-stroke oil um, I was actually gonna buy a quart of this but they didn't have it at my local uh, Home Depot in quartz so I'm gonna have to order some online and here's the operators manual probably gives you all of your starting instructions A Kiritz. Here's the blower itself. Take it out, get it assembled, and we'll see how it is. That's, uh, everything that you get in the box. Alright, so that rotational control lever just clips on. I'm going to install the posi lock system. Just like all Echo products, it's backed up with a five year consumer warranty, a two year contractor warranty and a 90 day rental warranty all right so i'm gonna go mix up some fuel at a 32 to 1 mixture for breaking and i'll be right back and we'll give it a start up all right so i haven't started this up yet turn it to the on position you can see the primer bulb has no fuel in it i put some 32 to 1 castro oil in this turn the choke on and uh, we'll prime it up alright and uh, we'll see how it goes So I just ran the Echo for a little bit and uh, the engine's starting to be broken in now and it's running better and it's running way smoother and I'm actually so surprised at the power that this thing delivers and I'll start it up it's got a lot of compression and I'll actually give it a pull now and it should start up first pull Here's control features nice all wide open like on the home light one where you can only set it out wide open. You can set it out whichever speed you want. Let's say I wanted to set it at a small or slower speed, turn it a little bit, and it'll stay there. If you want to set it at a higher speed, the more you turn it, the more 
more gas it gives, and it stays there. So I, like, It's so, it's so anti-vibration in your hands when you grab it. You can't feel any vibration at all. It's very easy to use. It's very, it's a very, a very good leaf blower. All right. So as you can see, there's quite the amount of leaves here, and I'm gonna see how the PB250LN works in these, and I'm gonna go start it up, and I'll walk over here and I'll start blowing the leaves. As you can see in a few effortless passes, we got a nice line of no leaves. And that wasn't even full throttle either. You could see I was blipping the throttle a little bit there, but it wasn't full, like it wasn't full out because I still am braking in the engine. Um, the highest I actually took it up to is around half throttle and you could see it had plenty of power to do as I wanted. But anyways guys, thanks for watching this video. I have to go uh, clean up my yard. I got quite a bit of leaves to clean up. I'm going to put this thing to work. So, thanks for watching. Comment, rate, and subscribe. And uh, once again, guys, this was another video by Pimpin' Pens. Peace out.